Hey guys, welcome back to Tarot by Cherie. Hope everybody's doing well. Guys, if you watch my channel, please like and subscribe. It helps me out tremendously. And guys, if you have a burning question, I am doing a $15 reading uh, for the time being until I can't do it at that price anymore. Um, if you want a reading, just click on the word Aquarius underneath the video and let's get started. All right, I'm seeing some planning for this, with this, for this, or with this new beginning, guys, okay, I'm seeing um, uh, a feminine energy who is just coming out of some kind of alone time or just being alone for a while, and I'm seeing this incredible happiness and joy uh, coming to you, okay, um, I'm seeing this uh, masculine over here, all right, who is, looks like wealth. I'm seeing this person is wealthy, um, and I don't know what the connection is just yet, but I have like a new beginning. I have a feminine, I have a masculine, I have some planning and, and a lot of happiness, okay? So then something ended, all right? Something ended due to some toxic behaviors. Um, there was something that somebody wanted that didn't turn out good okay it turned out really bad this is something you thought was going to be good for you but it wasn't um, this was too small of an offer for you and now you need to balance things out okay because you're feeling emotionally frazzled all right there are things going on behind the scenes for you guys for your betterment okay and i'm seeing romance over here i'm seeing this person wanting to come in and give you their cup which is love okay um and i'm seeing a lot of stability with this person coming in and they want you to use your intuition guys use your intuition make sure this person you know there's no red flags there's no uneasy feeling with this person okay because I'm seeing that you are great being by yourself. You don't need anybody. You know how to make money. You have your own stuff, okay? And you're self-assured. And right now, you're free as a bird. You're feeling good. You're feeling happy, okay? But there's, there's some loneliness there, okay? And that is kind of like a weight on your shoulders. You don't like to be alone, but you're okay being alone. And then I'm seeing this person here who doesn't really take your feelings into consideration when they talk to you, okay? They're kind of mean or they're really mean, all right? Now I'm seeing this, you know, first here you're juggling your money as if you don't have enough, okay? And then I'm seeing this 180, and guys, I've been getting this kind of reading for the past couple of days. So I, again, I'm thinking we're closer than ever to this money that I've been talking about, money um, that will be coming into us. Spirit is promising us that this money um, is coming in. There's there's something coming in, some kind of debt forgiveness. There's a huge, big thing coming to us that, you know, we have never seen before. There's going to be a lot of news coming out, uh, things dropping. And, you know, right now we're not hearing too much, maybe a little. It depends on your source, where you're looking. Go on YouTube, guys, okay? Because the stuff you're seeing on TV in the papers as well, mm, nah, nah. That's all I'm going to say. All right? So here, I'm seeing a lot of celebration and happiness. I'm seeing money. I'm seeing prosperity over here, more money. And I'm seeing this Ace of Wands, meaning that this is the spirit saying they have their back and this is a gift, all this money, okay? And that they're guaranteeing it. They're saying that not only is it coming in, but it's going to keep flourishing. It's going to keep going. So it's not like a one-time deal, all right? Which makes me believe that there's some kind of like payments coming into us, okay? Um, this this isn't going to be something negative. It's going to be something positive, okay? Um, and I'm seeing a lot of happiness around this, a lot of celebration, and just people are going to be able to breathe like they've never been able to breathe before, all right? I'm seeing a lot of you um, 
right now there's a child or children that are being ignored okay that need your attention and also you're focusing on this manifestation right now maybe that's why the children are being ignored okay the manifestation you're focusing on is a partner a life partner and you're going to have a victory with that okay because you guys are figuring out that you're manifesting ninjas okay and you're manifesting all kinds of stuff you're manifesting people money and all kinds of things you're pulling it in just like magic okay because you figured out that positivity brings in positivity all right and here i'm seeing something's divinely guided over here and spirit over here saying connect connect with us all right because if you want to want to really manifest and you want these things to come to fruition and you're you know doing the right things in life we are going to have your back with all this and we're, we're going to help you okay we're going to help you so i'm seeing this lover's card and this lover and this manifestation okay spiritual card here i'm seeing like all this coming in for you all right so you guys and underneath this is the partnership card okay so guys that's a soulmate all right so this is this person this relationship this love is gonna be your justice guys all right it's being guided by spirit and I'm seeing more celebration, okay? I'm seeing somebody's, all right, somebody's, this isn't so good. Somebody's losing their job, okay? There's an ending coming to a job. Um, so there are going to be some layoffs, guys. You know, if you have even an inkling that your company that you work for is, ha is going to be laying off, do this in threes, okay? The type of work you do, go line up three interviews, go to the interviews. At the end, you're going to negotiate your pay, okay? Never take a job without, uh, I don't have to tell you, but, you know, never take a job without negotiating your pay and knowing what you're going into. So at the end, you just say, you know, this is what I need to make my bills. Um, I didn't tell my boss I was leaving. So, oh yeah, up front, tell them that not to, not to, uh, contact your boss because you didn't say you were leaving yet okay because you don't know you want to see what the offer is out there okay there's a ton of companies paying big bucks because they can't keep people and they need people all right so you have things fluctuating different situations out there so you know bump up the pay because they're going to come back and maybe say to you well we can't give you this but we can give you that all right and if you do this in threes you will land a job exponentially making more money than you made at the previous company okay and here i'm seeing stuckness um stuck Darkness is turning into uh, movement and, and celebration and this lover, okay, is coming in, okay? So this person's coming in and you're not going to be feeling so stuck anymore. But here I'm seeing some kind of inner conflict and a decision being made, something to do with, I want to say, family, okay? Um, actually, no, I'm going to say that this conflict has to do with work for some people. All right. So something going on in the workplace again, and then in the center, I'm seeing some kind of teamwork rather. This is teamwork. Okay. So, um, yeah, you guys are supposed to be like working as a team on something. And I guess you're, <laughs> you're not really, um, on the same page. All right. So, and then I'm seeing some, you know, sadness here and some kind of decision possibly you're making on this job. You're wondering, is this job for me even kind of thing? All right. So here you, you're the star. Okay. And I'm picking up on this feminine. Wow. Am I picking up on this feminine? Okay. You're feeling left out in the cold. Um, you're, you know, most likely a, a mom and, you know, they want you to know that you're the star. Remember, remember who you are, okay? And don't take any guff from anybody. Don't let anyone disrespect you, okay? I'm picking up on your personality. You're laid back. You don't sweat the small stuff, but you're feeling alone right now, okay? You're feeling alone in your plate. And actually, you know, your heart is breaking. Someone told you a lie. Someone you, you love and trusted told you a lie. And you know, it looks like it had something to do with money and, you know, you're seeing this now and it's just breaking your heart. All right. I'm seeing a, a person coming in. This is romantic. Um, 
And right now, though, you're feeling stuck and you're going through this tower moment and you're feeling defensive, okay? And all this is getting in the way of your happiness and allowing this person energetically to reach you. And, you know, you're all closed up and you're going through this tower moment. All right, guys. So, you know, please do the exercises I tell you, you know, the deep breathing exercises, blowing out the stress, visualizing when you blow out. All those emotions are going out into the universe and dissipating and turning to nothing. Okay. They want you to rest. They want, you need peace and quiet, some of you. You need it desperately. Okay. Um, so... Get some rest. Take some time to yourself, okay? Um, here I'm seeing a lot of happiness overflowing from somebody's cup. Joy and happiness, okay? And I can see why. You have the Ten of Pentacles over here. I'm going to talk about that in a minute. But right here, you're moving into new waters, okay? You're moving away from some kind of sneakiness, okay? And because you moved away from this deceitful person and you got strong and you moved away from them, you're moving into new waters now. It This is changing up your whole life. This is changing everything, all right? Because you're going to meet this new person who is going to be, you're going to be celebrating and somehow energetically all this money is going to come to you when you meet this person possibly even before okay but all those pentacles are you know money that's money so you know it looks like wealth coming in and love at the same time you can't ask for more than that guys all right here i'm seeing somebody's feeling um anxious uh, they're not sleeping good at night and defensive all right and there's something here about a commitment and this person is probably older than you maybe a few years older this person you're committed to all right and for some reason you're you're going through all this anxiety and you're feeling guarded with this person okay well guess what you have the world at your feet. You have opportunity laying in wait for you. Just go get it, all right? You don't, you're not, you're not stuck in an unhappy situation, guys, all right? There's opportunity waiting for you out there. You can just go grab it, all right? And here I'm seeing this person. This is romance, okay? This person wants to come in, and they're coming in with this flourishing wand, and they want you to get mental clarity on what you're doing and where you're going, all right? Because... You know, you're not happy. Don't stay in an unhappy situation. They want you to have this fire lit under your ass. They want you pissed off because they want you to see. They want you to get enough angry enough so that you get this clarity to move out of your unhappy situation and move into something happy. OK, there's good news coming to you about this new person coming in. All right. Um, and here they're talking about, again, your new cycle, which is a whole cycle of good things coming in, happy things, okay? And a variety of things coming in, and you're going to be seeing and hearing this soon, hearing about it rather, okay? You're going to get this communication. You're going to get this good news communicated to you about all these good things that are coming in, guys. And that is the reading. So I hope it resonated. I hope you enjoyed it. You take care.